so this is like middle of the day and i am on the other side of the ganges uh, just to give you guys a perspective of how beautiful kashi is and uh, i'll just pan my camera a bit now slowly to kind of give you a view of the holy city and the holy river beautiful ganges it's winter but it's it's hot uh, but the wind is blowing as you can see the waters are choppy and uh, so it's really really calm i think if i check my heart if i check my pulse i'm sure it's like at the lowest uh, this place just calms you down i don't know how i i've been walking for about five six kilometers since morning but uh, i'm not hassled one bit let me kind of try and zoom in a bit the clarity will probably dip but just to give you a slightly better view hopefully of the crowd on the other side but as i said in my previous video you know if you can uh, you should definitely come here if you can you should come here often i think this is the only place at least where i have been where life and death kind of assimilate i mean we all know that death is an inevitable fact of life but when you are in a city like delhi mumbai or or for that matter even smaller cities in the hustle bustle of life it's really hard to contemplate that one day you know you're going to be no more but in kashi you know you are you're basically kind of having you know some delicacy beautiful food or tea on one side and uh, in a street in a tight lane and uh, suddenly you will realize that you know somebody's passed away and a dead body decked with flowers is being carried away with the chanting of uh ram naam satya hai etc and uh, while in other places you know you would kind of feel a bit awkward somehow in kashi you know it's like as if this is this is the fact and you don't even blink i mean you may kind of hold your hands hold your hands and uh, kind of pray for the departed soul but that's about it I think that's the power of kash you know where life and death kind of mix assimilate in a you know in the strangest possible manner